Okay, what we got here is we got a, a program that uses the connect to uh, you, it uses connect and YOLO and the depth stream, takes that data, processes it, and then sends it to a PLC. So what we have here is we have on the left, we have the depth stream coming from the, the connect, the color screen. And then we have the, the PLC, it's Control Logix 5000. What we do is we use PyConnect to get the data stream, the color stream, and the depth stream. And then we take the color stream and we run it through YOLO. And then what we do is we take the bounding boxes, uh, take the center of the bounding boxes. And what it does is it takes the center of the bounding boxes and uh, puts it on the depth stream and it uh, and then it shows that onto the the bounding box the bottom right hand side and besides doing that uh, if you look here it says yolo int and yolo string these are the uh, the, the data that the bounding boxes uh, are receiving and they're sending it to the plc so what you can do is you can click on this. If you click on the, the depth screen, for example, there's the this uh, purple dot. If you click on it, down in, down the bottom here, it gives you the coordinates. If you right click on it, it gives you the depth reading. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move into position so it starts focusing on me, and we'll you should be able to get some feedback. Good. So you see as a person, and uh, if you look at the PLC feedback, it says it shows that it's a person. And if you look at the, the depth uh, reading for that person, it's like 800 and generally 50 millimeters. And as you can see, what it's done is it's taken a, the center of the bounding box and it's placing a dot on the left-hand side depth screen. And that's where it's taking the depth measurement from. So what happens is it just takes the center of the bounding box, uh, overlays it on top of the depth screen, and then extracts it, and then displays it on the bottom right-hand side of the bounding box. Then it also puts it out to the PLC. So, I mean, if I move, you can see it move. If I go back, the depth moves with me. Uh, let's see, you can see the chair there. See, it picks up the dog. There, dog. So uh, what I'm using, I'm using YOLO version 2 with uh, uh, tiny YOLO because my machine, my, my video card isn't that good. So I can't, it's not as accurate as it should be. So let's see if we can get that again. Dog. So it's, it's not that bad. And you can see it's picking up the desk. You can see as it picks up an object, puts a bounding box on it, takes the color of that bounding box, and it makes a, a, a dot that's color up on the, the depth screen. And that's where it's extracting the, the depth data from. So that's where those numbers are coming from. So, I mean, when I move, I put the dog down. See this? He's a chair. I'm a person, but you see it's going into the PLC. So if I move back, you can see the depth move with me. So, I mean, I pretty much got the coordinates of the live screen and the depth screen pretty much worked out. So if I go forward, just scooching forward, you know, it moves also. So anyway, so what this is, is this is PyConnect. Uh, YOLO version 2, a uh, Control Logix 5000, and it, and it uses PyLogix to communicate with the, the Control Logix. 
And uh, let's see. That's about it. Um, I'm, I'm going to put a link to all the code to do this in the bottom of this video. So <clears throat> good luck. Have at it. <clears throat>